Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you some of my tip up fishing mistakes this year. If you like watching me make mistakes as much as I do, then click that like button. I understand that one of the mistakes that I have made is the line that I'm using. The line that I used on one of the tip ups was 8 pound mono and it was 2 years old and it broke off. I, I understand that that was a problem so that's why I bought this this pull, premium polar multi strand braided tip up fishing line I got 20 pound test and a hundred yards so that's gonna solve my tip up line it's off brand because it's cheaper because I don't want to spend that much money and if you guys would comment any tips or techniques that have worked for you tip up fishing that would be very nice because I am just starting tip up fishing and I don't know that much and I'm just not that good at it. Enjoy. We got our first leg of today. Pretty much the first leg of the year too. I'm hoping I can get it. It's a it's a dead bluegill on the bottom. I don't it's not pulling right now but I, I think it's it's still there. Gonna set the hook on him, or? Well, I'm feeling it. Oh yeah, there's fish. Should I come and help? Oh my god, no, it's got off. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, yeah got another flag. It's running with it, too. Oh, I think it's... I think it's a big fish. It's got to be. It's got to be a big fish. Oh, crap. What? Oh, no. What happened was it ran out of line because it pulled so much line and it started uh, tugging, tugging on this. That's why I thought it was a big fish because it was going like this because the fish didn't have any more line to take. You should have set the hook earlier. Well, I was letting it take line. Well, there was no line to take. Yeah, I know. I didn't know that. You you said earlier, this is the one we have to set the hook on right away because there's no line. No, I said watch it, which we were watching. How is this thing still alive? This has gotten bit three times, and it has no scales on it anymore. That's a good question. Absolutely no scales. Like, well, put it back down there again, and hopefully see you'll how, get hit again. See how it has no scales? Like, that none. had to be like a northern. Well, I don't know, but... We got five tip ups out right now and we got one on the last the last one of our line we got. See there's one, two, three, four, and then the last one right here is the fifth one. Jake's gonna grab it because I missed the other two that we had. Not all the lines gone, that's a decent sign. It's really slack. A lot of line went out. For sure. It's broke off. Well, I said that it was probably gonna break off because we have eight pound mono on it and it got bit off. It got bit off by a northern pike. That's yeah, awesome. It definitely got bit off. That's that's awesome. I don't think it got broke off. I think it pretty clearly got. It got bit bit off. Bit off. But yeah. that's pretty cool. Awesome. Awesome.